Hey VA Rep family, I'd like to share with you what we've been doing with your generous donations for the Stop, Drop and Push campaign. We had an incredible opportunity to cover the cost for lodging and transportation for an amazing veteran out of Boise, Idaho. This summer, he participated in a deep sea dive that offered him a week of healing for mind, body, and spirit. Meet Bruce. He reached out to the Stop, Drop, and Push campaign to get assistance with airfare and lodging so that he could attend a deep sea dive in the Bahamas. Deep Sea Valkyries is primarily a trauma counseling program. All of our participants undergo 25 hours of trauma counseling in a group dynamic, and then individual counseling beyond that as they request it with our counselors. But for the fun aspect of it, we take them scuba diving for a week in one of the most beautiful places in the world. The voyages are a week long. We depart out of NASA Bahamas, and once we leave the harbor, we're actually at sea for the entire week. During the course of the week, all of our Valkyries will undergo 25 hours of counseling in a group dynamic with a counselor that specializes in post-traumatic stress. This year, the Stop, Drop and Push campaign funded one of our Valkyries, Bruce Cooper, and his travel to participate in our program. And this was an incredibly special thing for Bruce because the challenges that he is dealing with in his disability are rapidly deteriorating. And so in another year or two, it could be possible that he wouldn't have had the ability to participate in a program like ours. He just had a wonderful experience being in a situation where he's weightless in the water and his disability doesn't impact him. Do you love puppies as much as I do? Well, the Stop, Drop and Push campaign had the awesome opportunity to be able to sponsor an entire litter of puppies that are going to be trained up to be service animals. Our founder, Dr. Jennifer Lund, really understood that there was a tremendous amount of veterans who could potentially benefit from this service, and she had the expertise and the knowledge and decided that she was going to start a nonprofit and raise and train and place hero dogs. Our newest litter was born May 10th. It's six Labrador puppies. In about two and a half years time, they'll be placed as service dogs with veterans or first responders. Phase one is our puppy program. The puppies go out to live with volunteers in the community for about a year and a half. But around that 18 month mark, they enter phase two, which is advanced training. They move back into our facility and live in our kennel. It's at that point that they begin to really learn the skills necessary to become a service dog. After that is phase three, when they are placed with a veteran or a first responder. Once a dog is matched with a veteran, the veteran needs to come to our facility every day for two to three weeks. To make that easier, we have a fully ADA accessible cabin that they can stay in and the dog can stay with them during that two to three week period. It's a very intense process and the training is challenging and so it's nice to be able to offer that on-site accommodation. This summer, the Vegas chapter provided a $5,200 grant to a local nonprofit, Forgotten Not Gone. I'm here today with Peter and Kelly Goodry, founders of Forgotten Not Gone. What got you into Forgotten Not Gone? How did this come about? You know, we were so much physical pain that, you know, contemplated suicide and a way to escape the pain that I was going through. So it came from a, a horrible beginning, but uh, I found some solutions now and it feels good to be alive. Forgotten Not Gone uses recumbent trikes as part of alternative therapy. Founder Peter Goodry used bicycling as part of his healing process and physical therapy. He got to see a knee specialist, a GI specialist, MRIs, everything. The biggest thing they suggested was a recumbent trike. They think that it will help him with depression and anxiety. And within two months, he was a completely different person. All the bikes are just designed to allow the veterans to overcome their disabilities. Right. So we got 70-year-old veterans that have been riding with us for a few years. Just allows you to get out the house and uh, escape it. It may not be for every veteran, but every veteran should have access to it. So you're doing your part in helping the 22 veterans that commit suicide each day. If we're not there for each other, uh -huh. we're just not going to make it. So, on behalf of VA Rep and all of us, On behalf of VRF National, Treasure Valley Chapter in the Stop, Drop and Push campaign, we'd like to present this check for $1,051 to Bruce Cooper to attend the Deep Sea Valkyries retreat. We are now able to present a $10,000 check to Hero Dog, so please give yourselves a round of applause and chase thing. Thank you. Thank you, Stop, Drop and Push campaign. Thank you very much. Help 
us continue our mission by donating at stopdroppush.org, promoting veteran stability, one veteran at a time.